Hello everybody, my name is Mitch Tabian and this is another Android Studio tutorial. This one's going to be on um, making lists and connecting a on-click method to the list. So I got an example over here. Um, I got a couple of lists, one's South Parks, one's Naruto, one's Simpsons. So if I click on each of these, it's going to open up another list corresponding to whichever one I clicked. Click Naruto, it shows Naruto characters, click on Simpsons, and it shows Simpsons characters. So, alright, let's get into it. First thing you want to do is create a new project. We call it basic list view on click. I'm gonna call it on click one because I've already I've already done this and I already have it saved as on click. I'm gonna make it an empty activity and start it. Gradle's doing its thing. Build me that app. I think my computer's just getting slower and slower. There we go, almost done. <clears throat> Move this over here. Alright, so we're going to get started in main activity and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make some lists. We're going to make those lists that I showed you in that little demo there. So the first list is going to be TV shows and we're going to have one is South Park, one is Naruto, and we'll have Simpsons. Um, the next, these lists you don't really need to make right now but I just make them because I know I'm going to need them later. So the second list is going to be the South Park characters so we'll go Cartman, because he's my favorite, he'll go first. I think everybody loves Cartman. Um, Kenny. Kenny stopped dying in the recent episodes. I don't know what that's about. I just don't want to kill him anymore. Um, next one will be uh, Naruto. Oh, my computer's lagging. There we go. So we'll go with Naruto first, of course. And then we'll go with Sasuke. And then Wana Kakashi. And I'm gonna put I was gonna put Sakura in here, but I don't like her, so I'm gonna leave her out. Um, actually I guess I could just copy these and change them. And my last one will be Simpsons. So we'll go Bart, Homer. Marge and Lisa. Okay, so now that we have our our lists, we're going to make a list adapter for the first one. The computer is really laggy today. I don't know why. We still have to make this list view. So we're going to call this the list view one. This is going to be the list that we put in our first layout. Oh, I forgot to make the uh, list adapter. So you're going to make an array adapter of type string. And the layout we're going to use is just a plain old. Uh, boring simple list item that Android provides. Okay. So there's a list after. So this this list we need it's red because we need to define it in activity main, which we'll do in a second here. I like to usually type it out first and then go and make the layouts. Then I know sort of what I need to do. Oops, this is adapter. Okay, so now, now that we have that done, we're going to go go into activity main and we're going to create our list view. So go ahead and delete the text view that it comes with and create a list view, uh, wrap content, wrap content, sure, and just make sure you give this thing an ID. That's pretty much the only important thing here. So we're going to call it the list view one. 
that's going to be, there we go, so now that's good. Okay, so now that we have our list, it should, like if you were to start the app right now, it should display a list of, uh, it'll just say South Park, Naruto, and Simpsons. So we need to add on-click methods so that every time you click South Park, click Naruto, or click Simpsons, it's going to display the other lists. So we do that by doing a set on item click listener. So the list view dot set on, so you can see right here, set on item click listener, just click on that right there. Um, and if, if, you, if you want it to build it, if you want Android to build this function for you, just type new space on, you can see right there, on item click listener, just click that and boom, does all the work for you. So now what we're going to do is we're going to do a switch statement for it, each, um, each case here. This is, uh, we're going to use this, this variable value in the switch statement. In that position, and put the variable position in here. Okay. Oh, actually, don't need this because we're not going to do the intent that way, so that's fine. So now we're just going to do the switch statement. So we're switching value, and then we're making cases for it. So case one will be if uh, if it equals if value equals South Park. So what we want to do if it equals South Park is switch screens and display the South Park list. So to switch screens, we need to make an intent. We're going to call it South Park screen new intent. Um, this is kind of weird. Usually, oops, usually when you do an intent, you would type this and then do South Park dot class. Um, we got to make we still got to make this class, but that's that's usually what you would do. But I think because it's inside this override function, um, you need to. It doesn't know what this is, so you need to reference uh, main activity. So go main activity dot this, and then when you do the next part, you have to do the same thing. So start activity, and then you just put your intent in here, and you're done. And then break, and we can do the next case. <coughs> So we got two more cases. So uh, here's the Naruto case, and Naruto screen. This will be Naruto dot class. This will be Naruto screen. Oops, screen. And the third case is going to be um, Simpsons. Simpsons screen, Simpson, oops, screen, and this is going to be Simpsons.class. Okay, so that should be pretty good. Um, we just now we just need to make these classes and make the layout for these classes. Um, so I think I'll make the layout now. So we'll just go over to the layout here, go to right click on it, go to new layout resource file. We'll just call it second layout. That's what it is. Android will do its thing. And you, all you need to do is create a list view in here. So wrap content, wrap content. And all you need to do is put an ID. So we'll call it the list view. Uh, oh, my computer's lagging again. Cool. You can do it. Okay, the list, the list, no, nope, the list view, we're going to call it the list view 2. So the first one in activity main is the list view 1, the second one in second layout is called the list view 2. Okay, so now we just need to make these classes here. So we'll start by making the South Park class. So it's going to be very similar to main activity, other than having the switch statement. So I'm basically going to copy 
you can copy the same thing. Just go down to the adapter and copy all. Eh, yeah, sure, why not? Copy all this. Actually, you can copy up to here. Copy that. And sure. Delete this thing. Okay, so let me change this to we need to change this to South Park. And change the layout because it's gonna be second layout. And we don't need TV shows list. We don't need the Naruto. Why did I call that a final string? Why did I do that? Okay, let's delete that. That was kind of dumb. Alright. Um, we don't need the Naruto. This is why I made these. Um, and we don't need that. Because I knew we were going to need them. Need them there. So we just need the South Park one in here. So just put that there. And change this to the list view 2. And you should be good. This is red because we need that. And we need that. Okay, so that should be it for the South Park one, and you can see, oh, there we go, let's make that a cat there we go, so you can see that's not red anymore. Okay, so we're going to copy that whole thing again, and do the same thing, we're going to make a Naruto class. So, highlight all that, boom, throw all that in there, change this to Naruto, uh, change this to... Oh, sorry, second layout. Uh, we need to grab the Naruto string, which is right here, and replace with the South Park string. Change this to Naruto. That's the list view too, that's good. And we're good to go. So now we just gotta do one more. Do the Simpsons. Paste. No. Oops, I copy, copy all that again. Copy all this again. Paste. Okay. Simpsons. I'm going to grab the Simpsons string right here. Simpsons list, sorry. Replace the Naruto one. Oops. Simpsons right there. And I think we're good to go. So now if you look around, all the red's gone, so Android's happy. Uh, oh, we gotta do one more thing. Go into your manifest file, and you gotta add activities for each new class. So activity, there we go. Don't think you need to really do anything else. Just add those. Should be good. So the Simpsons one, add a Naruto one, and uh, what was the last one? South Park. Okay. So I think I think we're actually ready to go. I'm gonna run this on my on my real device because I don't want to wait for the emulator. Let me just turn it on here, and if it works, then we're good to go. Yeah, if I run on the emulator, it takes like I don't know at least five minutes to load up. But if I run it on an actual device, I don't know, probably under a minute for sure. I think it's almost done. Yeah, it popped up. Okay, so let's check. Oh, the South Park one isn't working. This Naruto one works. South Park one isn't working for some reason. Okay, let's see here. I'm going to try and film this all in one go. I don't want to have to edit anything. Yeah, my South Park one isn't working. Why not? Why aren't you working? Don't do this to me. I'm live right now. It should work. The, it's kind of weird. Self-park screen. Self-park.class. It's not different. What about in here? That's fine. Um, it's very strange. String is, yeah. Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to run it again because it doesn't look like anything is wrong. Kind of weird.
Yeah, I don't know. The uh, Simpsons one and the Naruto one are working fine, but the South Park one isn't working. Oh, it's probably just something dumb. What am I not seeing here? Um, nothing changed. It's just the list view. Something to do with this. Did I... Oh, that's what it is. This, this needs to be capital. Right there. Okay. So let's try again. The case was uh, different than what that actually read. Yeah, it's good. Okay, so now now your your uh, app should be doing something like this. You click on South Park, you're gonna get a list of South Park characters. You click on Naruto, you're gonna get a list of Naruto characters and Simpsons Simpsons characters. So thank you very much for watching. Um, I'll see you next time.